Representatives of the House of Fulani community in Tigno, Adamawa State, have criticized the Adamawa State Police Command over what they describe as an unjust handling of the crisis between Chobo and the House of Fulani communities in Tigno, Lamurde local government area of the state. The spokesman of the group, Aliyu Tigno, while speaking to newsmen in Yola, the Adamawa State Capital, says the state police arrested only members of the Hausa Fulani community and demanded their unconditional release. The Adamawa State Police Command arrested and detained 57 innocent Hausa Fulanis, out of which the Adamawa State Police Commissioner on 1st June 2020 paraded 18 persons at the police headquarters, Yola, before journalists as school police. Since that time to date, those arrests have been in detention in various policies without bail. From the report, it was the troubles that attacked and killed House of Lanis and destroyed their properties in Tino and Tito villages. There was not any record of any single loss of life or destruction of properties from the side of troubles. But yet, the Adama State Police Command could not arrest any Chobo person who were the perpetrators of the killings and destructions. Therefore, we, the House of Lanis, feel that the action of the Adama State Police Co uh, Commissioner is a clear injustice, bias, and discrimination against our people. Arrest, investigations, actions taken by all the communities, all the security agents. I'm happy the state government has already set up a committee to investigate that. And that whosoever that is found wanting definitely is going to to be blamed for the action he has taken. But one thing, uh, we are always uh, being cautioned never to allow our own personal interests to come into conflict with our own uh, public interests. As such, we are going to do everything possible to see that uh, the allegation is substantiated and we are going to. 